Hey guys, it's Gina Militia from GinaMilitia.com and today I want to show you how to quickly and easily selectively adjust certain colors in an image using Lightroom. On the screen now I've got a portrait of a model and what I want to do is I want to change the color of her eyes and I also want to make the color of her lips look a little more natural or neutral. So first thing I'm going to do is tackle the eyes. So I'm going to zoom in and I'm going to select my adjustment brush. Uh, so that's K is the shortcut for that. So hit that, you'll get the little drop down menu. And first thing I'm going to do is just mask in the area that I want to uh, change or target. So if I turn on my overlay uh, and I might just change it to red. Uh, okay, so the area that I'm targeting is basically the colored part of her eye. So what I'm doing is brushing on. If you make a mistake as you're masking out your area, just hit the option or alt key. All right, so I'm just going to brush that out, come back in and I've just come into the black part there so I'm just going to remove that all right and just come in here tidy that up do the same with the other side just mask that in all right make sure it's looking nice and tidy okay so let me just uh, come out a little bit all right, so I've got my area masked. I'll just turn the overlay off. Now to change the eye color really easy way is basically just to tweak the temperature. So if I want to give her eyes a, a warmer look or that sort of uh, the lion eye look, I can just tweak the color temperature up. So warm the eyes up and it's just targeting that area that I've masked in. I'll turn my overlay on again so we can see it's just that area because it's a selective adjustment. So I can warm them up or I can make cool them down and bring some blue in. And because there's some underlying tones of green in this image, I'm actually going to add a green tint as well to that area. Mix in a bit of blue. And now I've got beautiful green eyes uh, which I really like for this image okay the next thing I want to do is uh, change the color of her lips so I'm going to zoom in again okay and make sure I've got a new brush selected so hit new and I'm going to now mask in the lips and I'll show you with an overlay I've got a red overlay I'll just change that to green so you can see now so I'm masking in I'll do this really quickly. So if you were doing it um, on your own images, obviously you'd spend a little bit of time doing this. So I'm just masking in the image. Now I can select the auto mask and that might help me uh, get through a little bit quicker, but I find auto mask a bit annoying because if you've got like different textures that you're trying to mask in, it doesn't do a very good job because it'll stop where the tones change. So I tend to switch it off and kind of just mask in by hand. All right, so basically I've just masked in the area that I want to adjust. And so at the moment I haven't actually done anything to that color. I'm just telling Lightroom what area I want to adjust. So if I make a mistake, I just hit the Alt on a PC or Option on a Mac and just come back in. All right, so I've got my area masked. Just make sure I've got all those little bits as well. There we go. All right, so let's just zoom out a little bit. Okay, so that's the area that I want to change the color of. All right, so I'm just going to turn off the overlay. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to come down here to my drop down menu and double click on this uh, checkbox here, which is the color. And if uh, you'll get a little um, color dropper icon that comes up and now I can choose any color I want 
to change the lips to. So you can also use this on the eyes or anything that you want to change color. So um, I can add more magenta or I can go for a slightly more neutral color for the lips. So basically I'm holding down the mouse and I'm just going through all the different color options here. And I think I'm kind of leaning towards something like here as a more neutral color, something a bit more pink. Let's try that. So we've got before, after, it's kind of gotten rid of some of the blue. Uh, and I can maybe add a bit more green to that image as well. That might knock and that, that also helps adding the green tint there. So there's before, there's after, and I've just managed to neutralize the lips a little bit. So there you go. There's a couple of uh, quick and easy ways you can selectively change the color of an image using Lightroom.